Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's YC Rhino and it's time for my reaction to RuPaul's Drag Race episode 11. So last week, Malaysia Baby Doll, Baby Doll, Baby Doll Fox was eliminated and Sasha won her third uh, maxi challenge. Um, I don't know how I feel about that because... I didn't like Lucy's runway, but I thought Lucy did better in the challenge. So it begs the question, how much of the weight goes on to the challenge versus the runway? Um, we are down to seven queens. Tonight is the first episode that's going to be 90 minutes long. Uh, to be honest with you, I don't see the point. Um, I think at this point in the game, 90 minutes is too, it's too much. I know we complained. <laughs> I know we complained the first three quarters of the, actually probably more than half the season, but I just think it's too late now. I don't, I don't understand the point of 90 minutes, but we're going to get 90 minutes, whether we want it or not. If you are new to my channel, thank you so much. I appreciate you guys clicking on this video. If you're not new to my channel, thank you for your continued support. And I hope you guys enjoy my reaction. I don't yeah. think I did that bad last week. Right? Oh, bitch, that was quick. She knows her way around cleaning the mirror at this point. I don't feel like the girls. I don't think she was that bad either. Because of how do you all feel? I'm surprised. Yeah. I really expected to win. Mm-hmm. You should have won. Shocked. Lucy thinks she should win every week. I'm like right behind Sasha, who is technically the front runner, but I think I'm the front runner in terms of charisma, uniqueness, nerve, and talent. So, <laughs> always going to be in first place up here. Up there, uh, yes. In, in La Cabeza. I loved wearing my look. I felt really, really beautiful in it. Why weren't you pregnant, though? Yes, you should have been pregnant. She was very far along when she announced her pregnancy. She was far enough along you could see her baby bump. I feel like you're insulting me right now. And like, no, I don't I'm, want that I'm not insulting like, her because she actually was pregnant. I'm insulting you because you had a corset on. <laughs> so, yeah. I literally feel like if you're pregnant, you should be pregnant. <laughs> well, I think that was like iconic moment, I think. that's. I think that was the problem. Yes, she was. She was showing. Last week. Come she on, did. girl. So, well, yeah. let's see if Lucy admits on Twitter that yeah. Beyonce had a baby bump for that performance. Ah. We are throwing ourselves a Harlem Vogue ball, oh. darling. Oh, I was like, what is she talking about? <laughs> for all the people that are going to get so upset because these them. queens are going to be voguing, even if they're not really voguing, Nicole. relax. Relax. <laughs> he said, and lipstick on my teeth. <laughs> no bum there either. Girl, are you all right? <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Somebody gonna get hurt. Why are they all dipping? Somebody's gonna hurt. Okay. Come on. <laughs> She's like, you want to see somebody swing some hair? I got some hair. Here I what is she doing? <laughs> oh, that was cute. Oh, there goes Anitra. Doing the thing that makes so many people outraged. Ooh. She said, watch this, bitch. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> Please Category don't is... kill RuPaul. I saw stars that was entertaining. Anitra. Y'all know RuPaul loves Anitra's Walk That Duck. So for today's maxi challenge, we'll be performing stand up in front of a live audience at the Bubbly Comedy Festival. I wouldn't consider myself a stand up comic, but I do love some sit down comedy. <laughs> All right, well, do that shit standing up, and you got it. Lux, you've got line. All right, first pair. That means you're with Lucy. Oh my God, weren't they fighting this morning? Selena, <laughs> you can steal a partner from one of the paired queens. Ooh. Mm, are, are any of these particularly there funny? Is Selena. What say you? Ooh. I'll steal a queen. 
Ooh, who are you gonna steal? I'll take mistress over here. <laughs> oh wow. Marsha, you on your own, ma'am. It's alright. You can do it. Of all the challenges, this is the one that I'm the most nervous about. And this is the one you're gonna be doing on your own. You'll be fine. If I were to go in the middle, I would be sitting in the chair, running it in my head over and over and over yeah. again. Yeah, I'd rather go first too. That's me. Done. Next will be Lux And that way Lucy. you can enjoy the rest of the show. In closing, we have the Divalicious Divas. What was your like plan process. of like, yeah, what was your process of choosing us in that lineup? That's the way I wanted you I to go. I tell y'all nothing if I don't want to. Damn right. <laughs> I'm with you, Anitra. I don't gotta tell you nothing. And Lux are paired together because they are two of the thirstiest bitches left in the competition, and they both would do anything to secure that win. Hey, everybody should do anything to secure the win. If you're not there to secure the win, what are you there for? Explode. Oh no. Like how my head feels right now is how that old lady felt when Maganja was like, it's kind of like your vagina. <laughs> Yeah, you gotta keep pressed to it. Get some medicine if you can. Give it like, okay, this is a blessing. This is an opportunity for me to kind of shine on my own. That's right, this is it the is. First... I feel like if you get thrown off, it's gonna be like even worse for you because you don't have someone else to pick up the slack. It's only you. Yeah, she knows all that like stuff. You sh she doesn't need you to remind her. Yeah. But I would always try to give my mom little ways to come back into my life. Call my mom when I'm in the emergency room. I'm like, hey, I broke my ankle. I need you to come. Like, shows up and she goes, uh, what the f are you wearing? Because I'm still in drag. Oh. I'm leave me alone and forget I even ever reach out to you. Oh. Like, after that day, I have not talked to my mom in like years. I think that some of the things my mom has said and done are just unforgivable. Wow. So I don't think that I would ever have a relationship with her. Ooh. Shorty short. Rue has been wearing some really, really micro minis this season. What does a nosy pepper do? I don't know. What does a nosy pepper do? It gets jalapeno business. Oh, Lord. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. Come on, Marsha. I want to see Marsha do good. I'm sort of a newer drag queen, so being here has felt a lot like puberty to me. You know, my, my body is changing. I'm finally a B cup. <laughs> um, oh, God. <laughs> and everybody at home kept telling me how pretty I was, which begs the question, where were you when you realized your entire hometown was lying to you? <laughs> The judges. So this I don't mind the, the bit. I don't like the wig. The wig is distracting that, uh, me. Your critiques have got some of these girls really nervous. <laughs> and when I say these girls, I do mean myself. I am very nervous <laughs> around you. <gasps> these two are some of my closest friends in the competition. So I can tell you from a really sincere place that they're both rotted garbage people. <laughs> Thank you all so much. Yeah, it might be enough to be safe. She better slay that runway. Ooh, Lux looks good. That's a funny joke. Her comedy wasn't half bad either, am I right? You take the white strips, okay? Now those pesky directions will tell you 30 minutes. Forget it. Put them on. Babe, you go to bed. Eight hours later, you're gonna wake up and your teeth are gonna be white. They'll be on your pillow, but they will be white. <laughs> How, oh, honey, I bet they get so white, they say, can I speak to the manager, please? <laughs> a sugar daddy. A sugar daddy? <gasps> Actually, I do. <laughs> I so Sweetheart, listen, if I wanted a sugar daddy, I could probably get his number from you, right? <laughs> oh, of course, of course, of course. Legend, an icon, a star, a former Miss Continental in a trailblazer in our community. <laughs> and the other one is Anitra. <laughs> They were good. They were good. Queens, you know. Why is she dressed up like Patsy? We're living the California dream. You know what I mean? Or Ivanka. I'm not sure which one it is. You know, sex is a misdemeanor. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. The more you miss, the meaner you get. Sex is a lot like playing bridge. What do you mean? Well, if you don't have a good partner, you better have a good hand. That wig is terrible on Sasha. You're forgetful. Wait. Um, weird. Yeah, I did that. Oh, oh, oh right, right, right. <clears throat> what were we talking anyway. about? Wait, what were, we, what were we talking about again? Well, I'm feeling a little bad for him at this point. I'm not. God, 
this day is lasting longer than. <laughs> Visage's balls are so big, she lovingly refers to them as Latrice and Eureka. <laughs> Ooh. But unlike Latrice and Eureka, Michelle's balls have lasted an entire season of Drag Race. I think Sasha kind of saved that one there toward the end, but the first part of it was not good. Look at all the sexy men in the audience. Ooh, you're right. Rude does look good tonight, doesn't he? <laughs> it's hard to get a man sometimes. They can handle all this. I had this prosthetic belly. It was out to, like, here. Oh, <laughs> and there was this fine, hairy and veiny, and he was like size six foot five. He came over to me, right? He said, I want to feel that baby from the inside. You keep the belly on, bitch? Duh, you can't get pregnant twice. <laughs> <laughs> so I text Trey, I put on my chunk glass, I run over, I open the door. <gasps> Trade is bent over the dryer on its final spin cycle. Yeah. I'm like trying to get in. Reach, reach, girl, reach. reach. So I whisper in his ear, right? I'll be right back, Bumpy. <laughs> <laughs> I run upstairs. He's vanished. It was just me, my unborn child, and a hot, steamy load of laundry. <laughs> <laughs> what? I was craving a little Mexican, so I hopped on the hookup app. He was hairy, veiny, and six foot five. <laughs> Girl, he was. So I started doing my normal. It's the same, man. He was going to make me go. <laughs> oh, I was ready to give me a piece. <laughs> Okay. Okay, girl. Where's the joke? The point. There's a he looked even better than his picture. So I took him to the bedroom. Speaking of looking and good, baby, you know I got to work. Mistress and looks really all good. Of a sudden he go Tell me why there's a big ass rhinestone on this man's bingo. <sighs> Bitch, you already know. Hey, so what happened, girl? Before I could even get back to the session, he was gone. What? What is that? <laughs> Ooh, hold on. <gasps> Ignacio. <laughs> you guys, thank you so much. You're gonna love me. That was gross. Um, and not funny. They're in trouble. All right, what's wrong? Ripper to shreds. Ripper to shreds. Sorry. Wow. This is what Lucy should have did with her uh, her design challenge look. I deserve death. Holy shit. <laughs> Wow. Swamp really got a makeover. I've seen this in uh, some of the promo looks. Cleaners in Transylvania are the worst. Yeah, they are. Oh, those shoes are cute. This look was inspired by RuPaul herself. That's cute. In the 1980s, just like this shiny kind of Liberace mad. I like that. Great jeans. From the house of Oh, that's cute. That rem this reminds me of something I've seen before. Who had? Did somebody wear something like this before? Am I thinking Britney? It's cute. It's really cute. Is that a Beyonce look or a Britney look? Concept is a lotus shredding through the mud and coming out to blossom on top of the lake. And I'm giving you green to represent the water and the murkiness of it. I don't see green. Is that green? Where's the green? No, it's black. What is it? Mismatch shoes? My mom told me no one knows how hard it is and what that takes trying to get here. My runway's dedicated to every Latina mother who wanted more for their family. Aww. Booked, burnt, and blessed. <laughs> I didn't burn, I crystallized. And the judges are eating it up. Y'all see the shape, honey. It's not my favorite. Honey, but it's okay. Welcome, Queens. All right. It's time for the judges' critiques. Lucy better win this week. Marcia, or Marcia, Marcia. Ain't no telling what might happen. The girls left. It has to be more. More, more, more. Are those uh, soda can yes, tabs Lucy, on her dress? Look at Rue's dress. Is that soda can? Oops. Wonderful job, Lux. You came here to win this competition, didn't you? Absolutely. Oh, yeah. If Lux <laughs> wins look, and Lucy don't. Oh, my mm. you, I'm going to try to talk about it without crying, okay? Because Those are soda can tabs. Just brings back so many great memories for me. Oh. You know, if you would ask me if, if I'd be sitting in this seat hosting a television show, you know what my answer would have been? Yes. 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 Yeah. Rue's always believed in herself. Yeah. Rue's always been a little bit on the delusional side. You were two preachers delivering the unholiest of sermons. <laughs> Thank you, ladies. I think we've That was an odd. That was a very weird critique she gave. Welcome back, ladies. What? I've made some decisions. What would those decisions be? Who's going to win? 
Lux or Lucy? Wow. So who's going to be in the bottom? Is it going to be Anitra and Marsha? You want... Are they going to both win? Oh, good for them. That's so nice. Oh, that's great. Sasha Colby. You are safe. Of course. Marsha, Anitra, I'm sorry, my dears, but you are up for elimination. Get ready, Marsha. I'm about to show you who's boss, bitch. <laughs> Good luck. All right. You're, you're, you're. And don't fuck it up. I ain't trying to. Oh, my God. <laughs> this is my song. Shantae. This is my favorite part of the song. They hit this when they hit this drop. All right, I think I need your gather now. doing the bicycle <laughs> yes they did so good that's a double shante i think i've made my decision shante you both stay anitra shante you stay okay you may join the other girls you're not gonna let you're not gonna let marcia stay <sighs> oh well marcia 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 you are gonna be a big, big star. Sashay away. Thank you so much to all of you, really. Look, like, I'm out. At the nose. Ow. My heart. Oh. Aww. Hi, I'm honestly not super bummed. I feel really proud of what I've done here. To have actually kind of put up a solid fight. I feel really good. I pushed my makeup skill. And I knows who I am She's now, so I mean, grandma. that's worth $200,000 to me. Oh. And remember, if you can't love yourself, how in the hell you gonna love somebody else? Can I get an amen in here? Amen! Right, now let the music play. Okay, guys, that was it. That was episode 11, and Marsha, Marsha, Marsha is gone. I really liked Marsha. I wanted to see her make it further in the competition, but I understand why she was eliminated. I, I thought that lip sync was so good. I thought that could have absolutely have been a double Shantae. I was very entertained, but those are two, probably one of my, actually now, yeah, those are probably two, were two of my favorite queens this season. And that's one of my absolute favorite songs. I love that song. So, um, yeah, so sad to see Marsha go. Uh, congratulations to Lux and to Lucy for their double win. Um, for a second there, I thought it was just going to go to Lux. <laughs> and I did not know how Lucy was going to respond to that. So luckily she has another win and now her head will be even bigger than it already is. <laughs> If you guys enjoyed this reaction, I would love it if you could give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, now would be a great time to do that. I'll see you guys later.